IT'S A BIG PROBLEM ACROSS OKLAHOMA CITY AND NOW THE CITY IS CRACKING DOWN. SO WE ARE TALKING ABOUT PARKING IN YOUR LAWN. NOW IF YOU DO IT, YOU COULD SEE A DRAIN ON YOUR BANK ACCOUNT. KOCO'S DAVE DETLING WITH THAT STORY. IT'S NEW AT 10 TONIGHT. IT'S A SUMMER OF CITATIONS. HERE'S ONE RIGHT HERE. AND OKLAHOMA CITY CODE ENFORCEMENT OFFICERS LIKE TAMMY BRIM ARE READY TO WRITE YOU UP. MY INK PEN, <laughs> MY CITATION BOOK AND A CAMERA, AN ANTIQUE CAMERA. Her materials do the job, and if your car or truck is parked on the front lawn, you'll most likely find an officer like her standing at your property line taking pictures. Last year, we received a little over 13,000 complaints, and I believe we issued a little over 10,000 citations. The city says it's not just a blight, it can also be dangerous. Like I said, they can drive across utilities, which damages utility lines. And it is a blight. When you, when you see a chronic offender, it's just nothing but mud. On any given day, Brim can write up to 30 citations. Okay, Most of the reporting the comes from anonymous callers at the city's action center. The city says to avoid fines and decreased property value, park on a driveway or a solid surface. I think a lot of it is um, it could be lack of knowledge that they think because it is their own property that they can park anywhere they want to. So they pull up on the yard and, and that's where they park. Dave Detling, KOCO 5 News. And you know, those citations will cost you about 100 bucks. The city says you can always contest them, but you should not ignore them.